Good morning, dog. Concert, Spirit Week, and more right after the pledge. Please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, and invisible, with liberty and justice for all. For this week's Spirit Week, today is Frankfurt gear or blue and white, and tomorrow, May 16, is dress up as if you were in kindergarten. Wednesday, May 17, is neon or tie dye. Thursday, May 18, is dress up like a teacher. And Friday, May 19, is college gear. Also, don't forget to come see the Spring Music Concert this Wednesday, May 17, at 7 p.m. Tickets are only $5. Now, let's send this to sports and weather. Thanks, Brian. The varsity baseball team celebrated our seven seniors and their families Friday night. Jaden Skinner, Quincy Perry, Chris Gilgihosa, Brian Valdez, Jose Lopez, Victor Cruz, and Austin Penry have all represented the baseball program and school well during their careers. After the pregame ceremony, the team came out and dominated a 4A powerhouse McCutcheon, coming away with a 12-2 win in a five innings. Jaden Skinner hit his second home run of the season, and Matthew Beharry hit the third. Austin Penry, Carlos Lopez, Brian Valdez, and Victor Cruz all pitched well in the win. The football call-out meeting has been moved to Thursday in Coach Byers' room during community. We will be going over summer weight programs and practice schedules as well as jersey information. And Dogs finished eighth in conference Rocky Ridge Golf Course 1 over the Frankfurt Golfers Saturday during the Sagamore Conference tourney. Bogies and worse seem to be scored of the day and the Lynx men carding only 10 pars as a team, resulting in a score of 407. Jackson Rays 99 led the scoring with Harrison 101, Edwin Wayne Scott 102, Luke Beardsley 105, and Alex Taylor 110. North Montgomery placed first with a 324 score, and NM Hayden's tourney with medalists with a 76. Now let's take a quick break from sports and send it to Garrett for the weather report. Thank you, Holden. Walking into school today, we experienced temperatures in the low 50s. And as the day continues, around lunchtime, we'll begin to see the temperatures in the high 50s and low 60s. Meanwhile, in the high of the day, reaching 71 degrees at around 6 and 7 p.m. And for tomorrow in the morning, around 8 a.m., it is expected to be around the mid to high 50s for a nice start to the day, while climbing into the 60s shortly after 1 p.m. While the high is sitting around 60s throughout the rest of the day and sending us into the night, temperatures will begin to fall back off into the 50s as the night continues. That's all for your weather report. Now, I'll send it back to Holden for more sports. Thanks, Garrick. The Sagamore Athletic Conference track meet was split in two days this year. For the first time ever, the field events were held on Thursday and the running events were held on Friday. Overall, the team struggled on Thursday, but our staff was incredibly proud of how our kids were able to bounce back and have a great day on Friday. The girls' conference placers were Jocelyn Ramirez third in high jump, Sierra Flores, 5th in discus, Ashley Zhang, 6th in pole vault, and 4 and 8 team of Emily Mora, Naomi Garcia, Chrysalyn Shipley, and Elena Ramirez got 5th. Anna Beardsley, 6th in 100 meter hurdles, and a 4 by 1 team of Kate Kimboa, Anahi Gomez, Abby Garcia, and Alexi Reed got 6th. Alexi Reed got 7th in 300 hurdles, Ashley Vasquez Rivera, 8th in the 300, 300, 200 meter, and the 4 by 4 team of Ella McAtee, Emily Mora, Ashley Zhang, and Lexi Reed Gill got six. The boys' conference placers were Jacob Bo Burns, fifth in discus, third in the 200 meter, seventh in the 400 meter, and Ethan Hudsmith, fourth in pole vault, and 4 by 8 team of Marcelo Cervantes, Marco Reyes, Daniel Pritchett, and Alex Lopez got sixth. Angel Perez got fourth, I mean, fifth first in the 1600 meter and Chris Angeles got fourth in the 1600 and third in the 3200. Four by one team of Dennis Barkley, Caleb Boggs and Troy Kimboa and Jonathan Bautista got sixth. Garrick Burge sixth in the 300 meter hurdles and the four by four team of Garrick Burge, Jacob Burns, Angel Perez and Marco Lopez got eighth. Best of luck to our athletes as they enter sectionals this week. The girls will be at Harrison Sectional on Tuesday, and the boys will compete at West Lafayette on Thursday. That's all for sports. Now back to your hosts. For lunch today, in lines 1 and 2 is cheeseburger, and line 3 and 4 is pizza. A big happy birthday goes out to Jocelyn Sarzes and Madison Dilk. That's all for the morning announcements. Make sure to like, subscribe, and have a great day.